Do you know that without a crystal ball you can predict exactly tops and bottoms of any instrument on the market? Do you know that predicting market tops and bottom has nothing to do with magic and you can get the hitting rate of over 75%? Hello, buongiorno, namaste, bonjour, mahaba, guten tag, good day to you trader. This is Mario, Forex Other Way, the channel for traders run by a trader. In today's video I'd like to share with you some forecasts for Bitcoin, silver and Brent crude oil prices reversals, which, based on my own personal calculating formulas related to square of nine harmonic rules, will occur in the near future. So let's start the rock and roll. Autumn is approaching and quite a few events might happen which will have a serious impact over the market such as Yom Kippur, such as uh, seasonal change of 23rd of September and so on, very important dates. First of all, I've got in front of me Bitcoin daily chart. Red vertical lines you see on the chart show reversal points cal calculated by my own secret formula. These of you who had a private training with me already know how to calculate this, these points. Quite a few mathematical equations which allow to convert price into time based on WD GAN square of 9 principle. So these turning points were calculated well in advance and as you see in front of me they are quite accurate. They are based on Bitcoin high by the way, the high made on December 17, 2018. So it looks like it looks, so we got the high over here 2018 the high was far away from here, this daily chart as I told you. 2018 it was somewhere here, you remember, tops of the tops on Bitcoin. It was nearly 20, uh, 20 grand and on some markets uh, it's been quoted $25,000 intraday I think. Uh, just uh, the last speculative hit of the market. As you see, pretty accurate over here, we got top here, we got end of correction here, we got top here, bottom here, top here, and now we are expecting the next one, we are expecting the nearest possible reversal point on Bitcoin. Conform my calculating formulas will take place on October 6, 2020, which is this line, and the next possible Bitcoin turning point, I would say, is going to happen on November 28th. But November 28th is Saturday, then probably it will occur on 27th Friday or 30th Monday, November. 30th November or 27th of November. That's shortly for Bitcoin. The supported resistance points, how to calculate them, how to find them. I also teach on my, on my training courses, my training sessions, so you might learn it over there. At the moment, uh, we are not talking about it. We are talking about the time when it's going to reverse. The next one, the next one is silver. We got silver over here. And so the next silver. Again, we are on a daily chart because these calculations, they work on 15 minutes chart, 30 minutes, one hour chart. But I think the most precise are on daily charts because there is less noise on daily charts than on the lower time frames. So the calculation which I've got over here, these turning points, which as you can see, this one, this one, this one there, they are perfectly hit. So they've been calculated based on this law over here. It was calculated based basically on the first starting candle of 19 March 2020. And again, vertical lines show calculated swing turning points, as you see. Shows the dates of turning points of these reversals 
or local corrections which took place as well because here's the end of the local correction is not the end of the swing the end of this first swing was here but it hasn't been calculated by this method because it's too short period of time well i'm not going to get into the details about it and as you see the forecast just missed only a few points basically they are really accurate and then what's important start even the last one this one on september 1st it seems to be a decent signal for a downswing as you can see we'll see what's going to happen later on at the moment but anyway they are very very accurate so the next swing on silver price probably will take place on september 28 and the next one is i cannot mark it is october 26 2020 which should be somewhere here 20 oh i nearly hit it 26 october 26 2020 so we got two potential turning points try to observe these two days 28 of september and 26 of december so we'll see whether the market is willing to continue the rally which started on march 19 or whether it will try to make a deeper correction or maybe the correction started right now but at the moment we got a strong buying pressure here at this level on silver you can realize by all these weeks pushing upward the market pushing the market north so we might expect that the market will try to go further to break this uh, this resistance over here at 29.50 around and try to go go higher so well next one brent crude brent crude where we've got brent crude here we go that's the brent crude this is calculations made already obviously i've hidden the calculation methods methodology just to to make it more lisible and just to hide it because it's not for everyone so the starting point the starting date for brent crude i took 24th, 24th of december 2018 as you remember 24th of december 2018 is here this candle based on this candle which uh, the low the closing price was about 50 dollars and a half based on this price i made a projection i made this calculation again as you see pretty accurate so this chart is again calculated by this my formulas based on this low of 24 december the results of this harmonics work extremely well what means what i wanted to stress that the starting point for the calculations has been chosen in the right way because as you might know as wd gans used to say when you start it right the results will be as you might expect showing you the tops and bottoms in the future so once again all these lines all these da dates have been projected based on this starting point this candle the bottom of this downtrend which ended up on 24 december 24 of december 2018 and all these ellipses in purple color marked here show you show you the hits and mostly they work pretty well as you see obviously it didn't show this one and this one but there is another method to to calculate them and well if you want to know something more about it just send me an email and you'll find out how you can learn this method forecast for the future what's gonna to happen the next turning point oh here the last one at 11th of september was okay it was calculated properly this one on 8th of june as well and this bottom at 24th of uh, of july was nearly it was uh, over here this week on this candle was probably hunting the stops and then the market rise 
substantially over here. It's not that big rise, but you can realize it's quite a few points which the market has risen from this level. It's, it's a nice a couple of um, uh, three or four dollars at the moment. The small swing we were trying. This one, it seems uh, starting on 11th of September, seems to be much bigger. And maybe it will be a good starting point to calculate the next uh, cycles in the future. At the moment, we got the cluster. I've got the cluster calculated here. The next important time cluster is 1st of November 2020 on Brent crude. I stress this is for Brent crude oil, US dollar, and the cluster shows 1st of November 2020. But you know what? It's very interesting. On November 1st, I've got calculated quite a few clusters for many different instruments from different starting reference points. So with different starting points. And there are quite a few currencies, quite a few shares and quite a few commodities. Which we've got a cluster on this date, on 1st of November 2020. Well, it's pretty interesting. I haven't checked it, what's gonna happen. And let's have a look at what I got November 1st. It's nothing special which is happening at that date. It's Sunday. So it will be probably October 28th or November 2nd. Yeah? So it will be on Friday, October 28th or. Monday, the 2nd of November 2020. What's happening on the 1st? We got only opposition between the Sun and the Uranus. Uranus is uh, usually is, is, is big hustle, big trouble, many unexpected things. But I'm not going to talk about astrology here. Nothing complex at the moment here. But when you calculate it, when you check other harmonics from the past, straight harmonics or planetary cycles, you might find out that this point of first of this one of first of November is very harmonic for the future reference. So watch this date carefully. Obviously the details about how to uh, how to learn uh, from my training related to these projections of price into the uh, into the time based on WD Gun Square of 9, you can find down below. There is a contact details. Just send me an email. I'll be happy to, to hear from you. That was it for today's video. I wish you a very happy trading. Thanks for watching and for your time. Take care of yourself. I'll see you next time and bye bye.